because today we are doing an experiment. We're having such a fun summer and we hope that you are too, but the kids are home and I wanted to make sure that they were staying busy and having fun. So we're going to be doing a few different experiments and activities throughout the summer just to stay busy and have fun. So we'll be sure to post those. Today we're doing a really fun experiment. What's in? We're gonna make it rain colors. We're going to make it rain the rainbow. So these are the supplies that we are going to use. You're going to need little cups of water and you don't want too much water because you don't want to dilute your color but you want enough water that we're going to fill up our cloud and our cloud is going to be made out of shaving cream. So you're also going to need shaving cream and to make the color we are using different food colorings. So we're using pink, green, purple, blue. Pink, green, purple, blue. And then also you'll need a spoon or a syringe and then a bigger container full of water, a clear container so that you can see it rain the water. So the first thing we're going to do is fill up our little water container with our color. Look, do you want to put this color in there? Okay. Oh, we need our blue. Okay, do you want to make the pink? Really? Do you want to do green? Or purple. Or purple, yeah. Those are red. And in each one of these little things of water, we added about 10 drops of food coloring. This is actually our second time trying this experiment. We tried once before with Winston and things got a little crazy. He needed a nap and we ended up adding a little too much of our colored water or our rain. So we have learned that now we only need a fourth of a teaspoon for each color. So we're going to start using our shaving cream to make a cloud. So you want that to look kind of like a cloud would. A big fluffy white cloud. Okay, just something like that. And then we're either going to use a syringe or a teaspoon and you don't want to add too much of the color like we did before. So I'm just going to fill that up. And then when you put this in, you want it to be a little closer to the front. So we're just going to fill up our little cloud. You guys want to take another color and just carefully pour it kind of in the front of the cloud. So a syringe is going to work much, much easier if you have one. Here you go. Just put it like right in there on the side. Whoa. And we're just gonna watch it rain. I think this might take a while. And this might be a fail. I don't know. <laughs> Your little pink like has little drops. Experiment. It was like pretty cool. Yeah. It was more of a tornado. It was more of a tornado. We made more of like a little storm. Yeah. So we're going to try it again a few more times and see if we yeah. can get it just right. If you have any tips on how to get this just right, if you've tried it before, let us know in the comments below. If you would like to see more experiments, let us know what you would like to see because we're really excited to do this. We have a lot of fun. We did a milk experiment over a year ago. And after we did that one, we wanted to do more. So let us know if you would like to see them because we definitely want to try a lot more. Do you know what I want to do? What? A volcano. I want to do something that like explodes. I have a eruption one. You have? Oh. Yeah. So we want to do something like that. But let us know if there are any other experiments that you have seen that you think we should try. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you next time. Bye! Bye.